This week on the Highlander Report, the soldiers of 1st Battalion, 77th Armor Regiment, conduct a dual vehicle gunnery. Both Abrams Tanks and Bradley Fighting Vehicles participated to capitalize on the train-as-you-fight concept. Gone are the days when infantry and armor conducted their own missions. Now, the Bradleys carry infantrymen into battle, while the tanks provide an increased fire presence. Well, 177 Armor is a combined arms battalion, meaning that we have uh, two tank companies and two mechanized infantry companies. Uh, we fight hand in hand. Uh, infantry supports the tanks, tanks support the infantry. We couldn't fight without each other. So it's important for us to get out here on the range and shoot gunnery together like, the, like we would in the real world in combat so that uh, we get used to working with each other, we learn each other, um, learn about the Bradley, they learn about the tank. This helps us be a more effective, cohesive, combined arms fighting unit. We gain more experience and fight like we do in combat. So there's a better understanding now of what an infantry company does and what it provides to an armor company. There's a lot better understanding of what an armor company does for the infantry. Although the training is different, the competition remains the same. Tank crews still compete to be the best, but now the feud between armor and infantry is gone. I mean, we're back, we're friends back in garrison. We're buddies during war, but when it comes down to gunnery, it's cutthroat. It's absolutely cutthroat. Any any crews are looking for that extra. They're going the extra mile to train harder and be better than their fellow than their fellow wingman, platoon sergeant, platoon leader. For 41 AD and Fort Bliss, I'm Army Sergeant Mike Grimm, and as always, that's your Highlander report.